बताइए कि किस तरह की प्रेपरेशन आपको करनी पड़ेगी तो परदेश के लिए परदेश के टाइम आई थिंक ज़्यादा प्रेपरेशन नहीं की बिकॉज जो मेरे डायरेक्टर थे मिस्टर घाय उनका पूरा एटीट्यूड था कि इट्स बेटर दैट यू कम ब्लैंक ऑन द सेट सो दैट आई कैन टेल यू वॉन्ट टू डू एंड यू डोंट हैव टू अनलर्न वॉट यू लर्न सो ही सज द रीज़न आई एम टेकिंग एन एब्सोल्यूट न्यू कमर इज दैट यू कैन डू एज यूर टोल्ड सो आई रियली डेंट प्रिपेयर दैट मच Uh, I used to do it on the sly, and he used to hate it because I was very, very um, diligent, and I used to, you know, make little notes and, um, you know, take pictures of my own with little bindi or a big bindi or two plaits or one plait, in terms of my look or in terms of my mannerisms or in terms of the lines that I'm going to say or I'm not going to say daddy and I'm going to say papa and those kind of things. But really, my director liked it much more if I didn't do any preparation, and he used to get amazed that I used to. Actually, try and do a little bit of homework when I was told don't do it. You know. Which so. First shot did you give? My first shot was uh, uh, where I had to. Uh, it was in a temple because it was a Mahurat shot, and uh, I had to pour milk over the Nandi cow in a temple. So it was a very, uh, mm, very holy thing to do, and uh, auspicious way to start shooting. and the song starts ganga chali tu kahan hai to just turn and look and see where the voices were coming from so that was my first shot how was the inner feeling you know giving the first shot i had modeled a lot and um, uh, so I, i it wasn't like what am i doing and it was a silent shot so it wasn't unnerving at all uh, there were not too many people on the sets uh, as in, in terms of other actors there was just me so i didn't feel very different from what i had already done in terms of uh, um, things in front of the camera uh, i guess the anxiety only developed once mr amrish puri was there or sharuk was there and th- that's when i was like sort of anxious so i was full of anxiety or i was unsure but till i was doing it alone which is i think a very smart thing my director did because in the first schedule he didn't try and put me up with too many actors he tried and give me solo shots or just dance shots or just running shots throughout pardesh i'm running through half the film it was i think the longest running role because <laughs> excuse me um any time there was a sunset which was beautiful he used to just say ab bhago yahan se yahan and i think that opened me up and by the end of it i was like i don't want to run anymore i want to do some dialogues and so that's what happened you know sharuk was already a known name yeah so- I was bound to be nervous because it was my first film. Anybody in my place would have been nervous, but I guess it was his and attitude which was very important, and it was great because uh, he 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 tried and sort of run himself down all the time and say that oh I'm no good and all of that and um, he was very down to earth. Um, he always made an effort to come and chat us up first or talk to us first, which was very nice. and gave us tips and said this is how you should do it and don't make these kind of mistakes so that was very nice that was the village scenes shot the village scenes it was the village was supposed to be in dehradun but uh, the place selected was mysore because of the sunset and uh, we shot the entire village thing in mysore but it was supposed to be dehradun so that was the cinematic liberty Uh, that we took uh, you d- normally don't have such a beautiful sunset in dehradun you only see it in mysore but uh, cinematically they wanted it to have that golden feel and so that's why we shot it in mysore that was a good uh, good time because uh, most of the time we were on the fields running about um you know uh, there was supposed to be a wedding sequence also to be shot in the film so there were lots of laddus and mithais on the sets all the time and uh, it was supposed to be shot today but we didn't shoot it today so it was the next day so by the time the shot actually came all the mithais and laddus were over because there were so many people i mean there were lots of kids also in the film so we used to just hang around doing nothing so we used to eat up all the laddus and stuff like that any particular incident or related to that oh there are lots of incidents really good and bad uh, during your first film uh, but mostly good because uh, it's an overwhelming experience to do your first film everything is new and uh, i thoroughly enjoyed it I mean there's nothing like doing your first film and especially because I was doing just one film um I used to enjoy every bit uh, of the time that I was there on the set and um uh, family days are just so in US and where 
I think in the US we were there for 20 days. We must have shot uh, a good 16 days or 70 days. And we shot all over LA, Vegas, uh, Vancouver. Hmm. These were the places that we shot, mostly in Vancouver. Yeah, all the train sequences and all that was done in Vancouver, which is made. Fond memories of the US. Fond memories of US. All of it actually. Uh, because it was, uh, like I said, every day was a new experience. I mean, now sometimes it tends to get repetitive because you're moving from one set to another. But your first film, every single day is absolutely new. And um, you enjoy every bit of it. And there's a lot of innocence. There's a lot of wonderment. You're seeing everything for the first time. So I took everything in really well. And uh, we had great company. I mean, I had Apurva. And there were lots of other people. And... Um, we really enjoyed. I mean, I loved my Vegas trip. We hardly did much because it was mostly driving around shots and stuff like that. So there was no pressure about doing dialogues. You know, in your first film, you have this anxiety about, oh my God, am I going to get my lines right? Am I going to speak right? Uh, is my diction going to be all right? Am I going to fumble? Am I going to forget? So uh, Vegas and all that didn't have any lines. It had mostly driving around the streets. So um, I felt pretty <laughs> no pressure and I enjoyed that.